Hi, good morning. This is Lucia from Lucia Fig Tree. Welcome to my studio here in Glasgow. As many of you, I'm following the guidelines of the government um, and I stay safe and I stay indoor. So um, in these very unusual times, uh, the best way to cope with everything that's going around us is, is to do something that you really enjoy it. And as many of you, I have spent all last week trying to pack up my, my business, pack up my job, get organized so I can stay indoor, stay safe. And, um, and that is why I'm going to use this week to finish up and the last um, bits of my lovely blanket, Rise and Shine, which I wanted to show you today. Uh, it's been ages, I, I should have done that ages ago, but I never find the time because as many other designers uh, or many of you out there, I got a job, I got a, li a life beside crochet. So, um, but I'm going to use this week to do this. So, uh, so I'm going to show you my Rise and Shine. So my Rise and Shine is a blanket which I did for a magazine in 2018. And, um, and it's a lovely blanket full of colors and full of different technique. There are 24 different um, squares. And here is my original uh, design with all the names and the details of the squares, the 24 of them. And uh, basically what I was trying to do, I was trying to make a blanket which was full of colors, but also full of different techniques and uh, and uh, and uh, oh, every single of the 24 squares is different and you have bubbles you have uh, puff stitches you have log cabins you have a surface um, crochet you also have a little mandala and uh, some uh, tapestry crochet and uh, um, oh gosh there's still some more there is uh, um, like um, applique and uh, lots of different uh, patterns um, which are quite enjoyable um, to try and uh, my favorite square which is the little robin that you can see there and that's as uh, um, basically cross stitch applied to crochet so the idea is um, spend a week to get that sorted out it's going to pre-order today you can have it for a discounted price of four ninety nine. So you know it's a good way to just spend these next few weeks. And um, this is done with the two strands of DK yarn. I'm going to list all the colors I use. That's the original one. This one that you've seen is done with Stylecraft. But really, you can use anything you got in the house. Um, and it's a nice way to just try a different square every maybe a couple of days or whatever, and just put this blanket all together. Um, it's a good size. It's about under eighty for and under 80 centimeter for uh, by under 20 and um, I hope you will enjoy it so please stay safe stay at home and let's do that together and uh, let's use crochet to go through this next few weeks love you love you everybody see you soon bye